Good afternoon, good evening, everyone. This is Tessa Spade today. Welcome to Two Woo's Day. It's Two Woo's Day, August 27th, 2024. I get the day 240. Let's play, cute little kitty. So we've made it that far. That means we have officially 60 days to day 300. So we're getting really close to two, the, the two major and final milestones of this year. Really, really close. I mean, if you think about it, we have 60 days a day, 300, and another 66 to 120 days. So, what the? Like 160 days, or, or is it 166? Something like that. Until the end of the year. We are really making progress. But I will apologize for being a little bit late with doing this, some of this, because at the time of recording, it's 5.32. I initially planned on doing this a little bit earlier, but there were, first there were a couple things that Lily had to take care of with her mother. So it was just me and Sweet Pea here today, and once, when it's just me and Sweet Pea, I can't do anything, so sorry about that. But the other, the other thing was completely out of my control. As, as I was getting ready, to start setting up and doing any kind of recording. Our power went out. Again. I would have preferred if the power outage happened at midnight because then I'd have been able to do those space photos that Terra wants so badly, but no! It went out mid-bay. In deep temperatures. So it was, it was, it was hot. It, it was very hot. So we just kind of relax in that. I've been waiting until the house cools down enough for us to do anything. But Art had a decent day. She got her, she got her permission slips uh, turned in. So so we did talk with everyone. She, we she were letting her audition for the honor choir. So that got turned in today. Yeah, that got turned in today. But I want to touch on something uh, sweet pea related. The whole, you know, she she knows how to get into everything at this point. She knows how to bypass every barricade that we make for the hallways, the doors, all of them. She knows how to bypass all of them, except for the chain lock on our closet door. So, we're in for a real challenge. And we already touched on... I, I believe we touched on... Sneaky has figured out how to get the Nintendo Switch out of the dock from behind the TV. Turn the Switch on. Turn a controller on, select Animal Crossing, and start playing Animal Crossing. She started doing that, and cut down all of Lilia's streets in her Animal Crossing island. So Lilia went ahead and made Buttercup, not Buttercup, sorry, Sweet Pea. She made Sweet Pea her own character, and made sure to take all of the axes away. So Sweet Pea had no axes in her account. Or on her character. Well, Sweet Pea didn't take very kindly to that, and she decided that she needed some access, so she figured out how to go to Nook Shop, look where Nook Shop was, make sure she has enough bells on hand, and bought ten. Ten axes. She's not even three. So after she bought her ten axes, she then equipped one of her ten axes and cut all of Lily's trees down again. This is becoming a battle of who gets to keep trees. It, it, it's a battle between the hippies and, and, and the, um, and, and, and the, and the loggers. The hippies and the loggers. And right now, I think the loggers are winning. And she knows that I have a Nintendo Switch in this room, and she started trying to grab that anytime she comes in here, so I have to be extra careful at this point. I'm running out of places to put things out of her reach. And it's a challenge. We, I saw, uh, Tara saw his sunglasses rack was out of Sweet Pea's reach. No, no, it's not. She can reach the sunglasses rack, too. And let's just say... She's tried to grab the sunglasses there, too, and those are not going to be easy to replace if they get broken. And a lot of that is just because of manufacturing limitations. They don't make a whole lot of his sunglasses. So it'd be kind of a bummer to lose any of them, you know? Daddy! Sweet Theory broke a pair of Buttercup's favorite sunglasses, but, you know, it happens. 
I'll just have to go find another pair like that. Or buttercup. Uh, maybe, maybe this weekend I can do that. But uh, there's an awful lot else other than trying to replenish the trees that Sweetie demolished in. So I might have to double up those efforts and make a tree farming site on my island, dig them up, <laughs> and go give them to Lilia. I might need to do that. We'll see. Uh, uh, yeah, there's, there really isn't a whole lot else. It's, it's, again, it's been the heat and just getting through the end of the month. End of the month is kind of a lull for us, you know? And it, it's kind of on repeat. I feel like I need to get out of the house a little more. We are waiting on the not one or 5.0 update on Genshin Impact, which should star later tonight. It just hasn't started yet, so I can't do anything on that thing right now because it's probably under maintenance at the time I'm speaking. Probably. But by the time you see this, it will be under maintenance, and then you have to wait until it's done with me. <sighs> well, I, I do have a few other things I can do, I guess. Like, cook. I can cook. But... In the gaming world, there is a game that's coming out on Thursday I would absolutely love to play. And it's a game I've been really excited for for about a year since I knew... Uh, well, when I first heard of this game and how it was in development, I thought it was going to be one of those games where they say it's under development and then nothing comes of it. But it's coming out. And I'm, and I'm absolutely excited. And there is a possibility it would bring Terra and I back into streaming whatsoever, whether we go back on the Twitch or if we just stick on, like, YouTube. But the game that might get us back into it, depending on the situation, is Squirrel with a Gun. We, we do look forward to playing that one, so we'll probably be purchasing it this weekend or on Tuesday next week, depending on overall situations. We do want to get Squirrel with the gun when we have the opportunity, because we wanted to play that since we ever heard of it. <laughs> I will say the trailer looks absolutely fun. The trailer looks fun. Um, it's the Squirrel with the gun. What else can you say? Other than a rule. And then, um, Nintendo today put it out. Their whole, uh, indie live stream for other games that are coming out. The only one that really stood out for us, because there's no way we're getting Sims. That's wherever that Sims game is. Uh, uh no. Um, the one we did see that does pique our interest is getting... Gold Simulator 3 for the Nintendo Switch. So I need to find my SD card reader and get all the data on the smaller SD card that's in their Switch. And migrate all of that data... That data over to the other SD card that's larger. I have a 128 gig that'll work just fine for get all the data migrated over to there. In, ho in hopes of getting them Goat Simulator 3 um, again, probably this weekend. But again, it depends on if they want that or if they want to wait until November because November is when the physical copy comes out. So we'll see if they want to get it now or if they were waiting till November, we'll see. But I do know, I do know, Buttercup absolutely loves Goat Simulator. She loves Goat Simulator, so if she hears that Goat Simulator 3 is now on the Nintendo Switch. You might demand that we get Goat Simulator 3 this weekend. Because unfortunately, we can't just get it now, even though they're like, oh, it's, by the way, it's out right now. It's like, come on, give us a little time, please. Give us a little time to prepare. I love, I love these. The sarcasm partially impended. It's all sardonic, too. It's both sarcastic and sardonic. How about that? But I love when game companies and, and uh, platforms are like, Oh, they've used this game that's coming out. It's out now. I've been getting it as fast as you can. But, um... The, the good thing is the, the multiplayer on Go Simulator 3 for Nintendo Switch, the multiplayer is local, so you can play two players on the same game system, which is fantastic. 
Because unfortunately, I haven't been able to do a single thing multiplayer with my copy. Because the rainbow where I got my copy was only available on the Epic Game Store. I'm kind of bummed out about that because I don't like the Epic Game Store and I don't feel like buying the game again on Steam. I'm out of tempted because I really don't like the Epic Game Store. Sorry, Epic Games, but I don't like your platform. I just don't. It bugs me, you know? I like Steam. But I remember, Terra was always really slow to adopt gaming platforms. Because, uh, he, he does remember, I, I like, around the time people were really talking about Steam as a gaming platform and p purchasing games. And he just avoided his stuff with consoles. Well, uh, he also didn't really have a PC strong enough to handle games in particular at that time. Nor did he try, because, you know, he was a console person when he was a young adult. Now we stick with PC, because... Hooray, games and whatever. But we do a whole lot more. Well, obviously, I mean... Oh, man, we, well, there are certain things that are so frustrating that we do almost every single day on this computer. Nothing bad, of course, but it is frustrating. And I really wish we could have a fountain of our own in our IRL yard. Oh, speaking of our yard... We don't know when, but we know it's coming in anywhere between the next couple hours or the coming days we're gonna be on a boil water ordinance for a little while because the water line in forever house broke yay they were supposed to come out the day to fix that they didn't do it so there's just water leaking out right in the side of our house you can see the exact crack between the uh the um the uh, sidewalk pavement or tiles or you know, the sidewalk itself. You know, the, the uh, the separators, the you know, sidewalk tiles or whatever. But the, the crack, the, the one that's right there that separates it is precisely where the water is coming out. At least that's, you know, the, the weakest point of exit or whatever. Which means with how much has been leaking out, that is going to cause some serious erosion. So they really need to hurry up, because I don't need to have my kids sink into a sinkhole. Please go fix that. There's been so many things going on here. Power outages all the time, and now we have the... And apparently I heard there's like... Three. There are three water breaks. Four water line breakages throughout this, our city right now. There are totally three of them. I guess it's a common thing. It's just really annoying when it's in front of your house. And luckily, we are not to blame. We better not be to blame for it. But that does mean once they get started, we'll be on a boil water ordinance for a few days. So, power while you can. And luckily, Tara, Tara did break down. He finally did get Sasquatch. So, you see, he told himself he'd never do it, especially since they started doing, like, uh, New Year's Day started doing those Star Wars soaps that he didn't care for. But he, he just impulse bought one that was like secret rum or something like that, or island rum scented sash, sasquatch soap. And even I admit that that stuff smells so good. It smells really, really good. So later we're going to get that out of the way. Get the suds up and... We need a cool shower anyway. A bath would be nice too, but we will only do it with a shower, because it's fast and efficient. Even that if we have enough water pressure, you know? Anyway, I, I'm not going to keep everyone any longer. I, I, I've rambled enough. I know I'm not very mobile right now. I mean, I can try to be more mobile, but I think I just... Just by doing that, I think I just pulled a muscle. I need to work out. Does anybody have, have anything we can work out with at home? We could really use some of that because we do not live close enough to a gym to get a gym membership. I, I, I'd love to, you know, like, do some workouts and stuff like that, you know? Uh, yeah. Oh, so why did I always send that side quest? Anyway, I hope everyone is enjoying their two woos day. Um, we've enjoyed it as best we can. Uh, I can't really... attest to too much more, but we get by. We get by totally fine. But anyway, enjoy the rest of your two Wednesday, and I will see you all tomorrow on home day. This is for...
Well, first I have to say that it's still August 27th, 2024, day 240. Now I can say we'll see you all tomorrow on Hub Day. See you tomorrow, everyone.